times that's what's happening in your life Librans. beautiful energy oh my gosh so look out for this in this week and right, let's go a little bit deeper thank you so much for being here oh, let's clarify the five of pentacles for libras please let's go mm, this is the five of swords internal conflict conflict with others because what is this what is within is also without so if you're facing conflict inside more than likely you're going to be in living in an environment that is filled with conflict inside and out so i feel like that's what surrounded you oh my god this feels deep as if you were just you're with your family and you guys constantly argue and that's just the environment you live in and i feel like oh my god this is extremely powerful that's why the lovers is here the hermit and the ace of pentacles because out of imagine you're in a home where all of your family the family street they argue a lot back and forth with each other and something clicked in you libra what is it that caused you to just not continue with with your life like that you know you have something else to live for and so you you decided to maybe ignore some people be quiet what I'm saying be silent be more contemplative be easy on yourself love yourself more you know to love yourself more to not argue to not get yourself upset to not stress to not be involved in these type of conflicts and so just you making decision the decision to not want to partake in this internally and externally beginning to dive into yourself to really it's another sense of value being awakened in you when you decide to cut off certain things that are unserving cut off you know and not disruptively but just you tuning in and that's beautiful so I feel your external environment will change to match your internal and you're coming into harmony with the truth of who you are, your natural nature. I feel that like you are filled with love. I said it earlier, the stones say, Librans, you have a lot of love. You're, you're nurturing and loving. That's, that's who you are. Emotions. All right, let's continue. The hermit card. Okay. Oh my gosh, look at this. You see, when you went in, this is what you saw. You got a glimpse of it, of your sense of worth. Deserving more, deserving a better life, deserving to wake up happy every day, fulfilled, deserving to be independent. Just, I, it's led by your emotions. Because this quarantine got a lot of people, you know doing introspection where is my life going what have i been doing all my life you want to be more firm grounded more boss like a leader i feel like you just want that entrepreneurial ship where you're connecting with customers serving being of service being diligent in work having something to really do sharing your talents you want to shine out so you're creating okay this might be a business that you have created already so what I'm saying as if it is come together okay let's see further the Queen of Pentacles <sighs> So the Queen of this is a Taurus card, Earth sign. Hard working, put it, you know how to put in the work. And let's continue. What's this um here for the lovers? The Empress. The Empress card. Beautiful. Empress is truth. The Empress is light, beauty, 
connecting alignment with one's self going out in nature like so you might be doing all of these things being fruitful being creative there's a flourish of softness gentleness love coming over you something is twinkling in your eye i don't know if you're pregnant okay it could be something like that where you are feeling that baby vibes where everything feels beautiful you're about to be a mother and this could just be you in your business feeling this amazing this is what to look forward to in your week oh my god see what i'm saying aligning with your sense of self-worth your pentacles so you, this is could be you starting a business partnering partnering with others or <laughs> a product or service that you have created coming through together so it's not only in the dream state it has there's a there's been alignment with with this sense of um fulfillment in your money like an idea that you're now working on it's bringing in balance in your life so expect financial balance to come through to you the emperor so you have the empress and the emperor another twin flame energy hmm. love 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 you are the sign of venus here i mean you know your planet is venus so that explains why we have lovers twin flame energy you could be dealing with a twin flame another person here so the emperor is stability see financial stability feeling very powerful feeling grateful even um, getting through um, standing firm in who you are so you're feeling very financially stable right now you went into yourself you came out powerful and you're shining the results are showing here let's continue wow the ten of cups amazing energy fulfillment complete life fulfillment family love money everything that you have always wanted in life contentment your content you feel good you could be manifesting a home life as i'm saying this could be a love reading and your twin flame is here so let's look at that oh my god the family the home the land the money the 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 the, the businesses the children okay somebody that can hold you down somebody that you feel good to be with and that you know loves you adores you adores you this is amazing libra oh my god i'm so happy i really feel happy for you it's beautiful i feel like it's your wedding day and you're getting married and i'm like oh this is so beautiful <laughs> i literally feel like this could be your wedding day that's how i feel right just being happy for you seeing you happy yes give thanks give many thanks okay let's go messages the libras and the playing cards please use this come in playing cards for me give us something seven, <laughs> seven of ones all right we're not gonna go there i know you went through your bit to get where you are today so it's not like it came to you easy because dive even going into yourself remaining disciplined all of these things it takes work it takes commit commitment you have to be disciplined you know that's how you get through so but i feel like you are elevating you are going up to the next level you're being very focused right here focused on achieving what you want out of this life leaving distractions behind Speaking how you feel and just getting it off of your chest, getting it over with. You know, looking at yourself, I feel yes, great introspection is here. You've been doing a lot of self reflection. Okay, let's see more. Okay, so. 
judgment, power, command, authority, militancy, intelligence, law, 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 law. Okay, good day. You're being very determined about your life. Very, 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 oh my God. Very focused and intentional. <laughs> I can't talk. Very focused and intentional about your journey. It's amazing. I feel like you have support. You have aligned to some of your guardian angels. Perhaps they're sitting in your life. I feel like you're guided by the angels here to get through the situation. It's beautiful. I want to go even deeper. We have the Queen of Cups here. So there's love in your life, stability. You could be... Um, you could have a Cancerian in your chart, Pisces or Scorpio, that loves you, that holds you down a bit. A water sign. You could be embodying the energy of that water sign, femininity, grace, productivity, business, leadership, See, something is over, death, the end of all this conflict. That's what I'm saying. I know for sure you are manifesting because the ace of this is the, the the award at the end of the race. You have won. You have come through. Look at all of these cards over this side. Lovers, ten of cups, empress. Everything is just an ascension of your progress here. It's done, the conflict that you've been dealing with. And it came because you decided to align with your sense of self, your value. Yes, you started to work on yourself, your values, your money. It, it just get, keeps getting better and better for you. Amazing. The world, see? I feel like this, the world feels like you going internally, inside of yourself, and then you came out more powerfully. Get what I'm saying? You dived in with the hermit card here, into your world, into yourself, looking for answers, validation, approval, just self-love, in internalizing your feelings and thoughts, not looking outside because that's the fault here. When we look outside, if we're not feeling good inside, all we will be seeing outside is more, um, more reflections of not feeling good. So you, I feel like you went in because you saw that no one in your outer environment could give you what you really wanted. You were, you were looking around like, uh-uh, this is going to continue forever if I don't do something, if I don't make the change. And so you went into your inter inner world. You connected with, look at this. this. This is the twin flame. You went and connected with yourself here. As I'm saying, it could be you or someone physically came into your world, your twin flame, your person, the love of your life. Could be a water sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, or Earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, that came into your life, the world. But let's see. Mm. It came, yes, it came as a result of it's as if your fairy godmother, came, you beckoned her <laughs> because, our father, because you, there was something going on in your life, conflicts. There's a manifestation, a stagnancy of things just continuing to grow, grow, grow that you didn't want to see. You wanted to be out, out of your life. You didn't want this to flourish anymore. Well, it's not flourishing it well you know what i'm saying and so it's like your fear godmother heard your prayer your whispers your even your silence your your diving into yourself because they felt what you were going through and they came with a solution to help to transform the situation to make you come out more powerful okay powerful an offer of love water sign coming up again for you here Someone might have come in, a message of love came into you. Hmm. Some message came in. And you were like, hmm, you're like, I'm not sure about that. Or it alerted you to something. It told a message came in to 
that caused you to be suspicious watch your back her message came in to say something about your environment is not good for you or something of the sort the people around you and so you began it's like an awakening an awakening a message that opened your eyes to what the life that you are really living and so you prayed out went into yourself and came through for you the moon so you realize that this is the life that has been held back from you not by anyone in you know specifically but this is the life that you could have but you didn't realize it maybe because as i'm saying people the the, the environment that you are used to they are not living in a in alignment in a sense oh gosh i don't like how this sounds but but then you found a new way you started to create your own world you wanted it to be you you didn't want it to be the same life that you grew up seeing so like a new realization came to you that a realization came to you that you could actually have the life you desire There's a fire sign here, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, King of Wands, Diplomacy, Debates, Challenge, Intuition, Bravery, Courage. something peeled away maybe out of you an idea yeah 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 it feels like an idea was peeled away the high priestess the king of swords Whew. so it was a lot of inner work so to us it looked pretty on the table but to you, it's a, it's inner work, being intuitive, seeing challenges, facing obstacles inside, even sometimes being alone, going, slipping back and coming and not giving up. You went through your challenges to get to where you are. You deserve it. You had to block people, be disciplined in your emotions, in the way you speak, in your work. And that set you above the rest. Hmm. I think now you're able to see people for who they truly are or see situations for what it is, whether it's real love or not. Hmm. Taurus. Oh my God, I'm sorry see me editing this video okay <laughs> libras libra thank you so much for being here and i hope that this message resonates well with you i enjoyed this reading i did not plan on going this long but i kept it going because i wanted to see how it unfolds for you it's turning out beautifully so the recap of your reading is that you could be just fine aligning with the true nature of yourself or you are aligning with your twin flame because you're you have been going into yourself really diving into your emotions to pick up yourself um to be true to who you are to feel financially secure and stable and even in your sense of self-worth to know who you are and so it's it has it's all coming through for you so look forward to these blessings in the coming seven days thank you so much libras for being here all the best to you and i'll see you next time do consider subscribing to my channel for future reads. Alright, take care. Much love.